Coffee Chat Day 56, sit down, grab yourself a coffee, and enjoy the vibe. So, not much to talk about. I feel like a broken record. I open up like pretty much every video like that. But, um, what else is there to say? <laughs> like, you know, after around 56 days of sitting down and making these videos, it, it's like, yeah, there's really not that much to say. Like, I've already said everything I could say. Like, I worked out today, but uh, that isn't a surprise if you're, like, n not new here, I suppose. If, if you're a regular here, that's not news to you. You, you know that I worked out. Actually, you know what, maybe there is something to talk about. Because today, I'm going to my first pub quiz with my friends. And yeah, that's the most interesting thing I've had to say all week. <laughs> like, I don't know. I'm excited for it though, like I might, like I'm, I'm feeling very confident in what, like I feel very confident in my brain. So I'm hoping that I'll be able to carry the team or something like that. Except for in the pop media category, I'm, I'm losing that. Also, sorry for the hair looking clap today. Uh, I got back from the gym, haven't been able to take a shower. So we're just sort of dealing with a week's worth of unwashed hair plus sweat which is a very disgusting combination of things like you don't want that in your hair I'm actually really excited for next week because on Monday I'm getting highlights redone in my hair in case you didn't know I have like I like to my hair, I'm sure you can probably, yeah, like, right there, you see how it's like a little bit lighter? Yeah, so I'm getting those redone, and then I'm getting a haircut, and I'm getting new clothes. So, there's gonna be a whole new look to the channel, I'm gonna look different, or like, at least a little bit different. So yeah, uh, looking forward to that, hoping that by the time that happens, I'll have just like a bunch of interesting stories to tell because like it is hard coming up with stories to tell every day you get me like I've recently I've been thinking about doing like segments in the coffee chats or like going into the coffee chats with something to talk about but I don't want it to lose like that personal touch that it has because right now I'm just speaking my mind I'm just telling you like what's coming to my mind right now but, you know, like having like some sort of like, you know, just something else that like, all right, we can do this and that can be a part of the coffee chat. Having something like that does seem like it'd be pretty, like pretty fun right now. But, you know, I'm, I'm not exactly like an expert on coming up with like interesting ideas for videos. <laughs> I just sort of talk about what I want to talk about and just put it out there the way that it is. First beer chat's getting recorded tomorrow. That's going to be pretty fun. Going to be sitting out the back. Uh, if you've watched any of the previous videos, you've probably seen my back garden. My little sister actually did like a really good job like moving the chairs around so that it's like very neat and tidy looking. So it's gonna be fun like doing a video out in the new looking back garden. And yeah, I'm excited to do that because obviously drinking beer, like I'm a dude, so like it like that's gonna be very fun for me. But, you know, we'll, I'll, I hope that everyone else likes it the way that 
I'm gonna probably enjoy it. <laughs> Cause I feel like when I, like when I'm just drinking beer, I'm a lot more like free talking in a way. And don't worry, it's not gonna be a daily series. I'm not gonna turn into an alcoholic live on video, <laughs> but it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be pretty fun. Speaking of drinking, actually, uh, this week I've been doing pretty good on being a non-alcoholic. Like, I, my mother got me a six-pack of Miller yesterday. And I've, like, drank one bottle. And normally, uh, back, back in the uh, good old days of a month ago, I would be getting a six-pack... And I would just down all of that in one night and eat a pizza. And that was dinner for me. And now it's like, all right, well, that doesn't sound fun. So I'm just gonna, you know, eat normal food and not drink. And I'm, I'm feeling pretty good about that. But I still want to do the beer chats just because, you know, like I, I want to enjoy a beer every now and again. Like I'm, I'm a simple guy, like that's just fun. Like a simple, nice old, cold beer, sun setting, it's summer, we're sitting out in the back garden, that's just like, that's a good vibe right there. I think I just got like some hair in the coffee. Yeah. This hair goes through so much damage. <laughs> like, the amount of times I've gone to spark a smoke and just burned the ends of my hair off, like it, it's happened a lot of times. And the amount of times I've like been walking home from the gym and the wind just blows my hair into the end of the, of the smoke, it just, it happens so often that at this point, I just don't even care. Like, if my hair just burns off, then it burns off. It's fine. <laughs> Actually, I'm not sure if I'm really meant to be talking about this, but just for the sake of, like, being open, open about my faith and stuff, uh, I was making a list of, uh, like, sins that I want to confess next time I go to confession. Because I haven't gone to confession in eight years. And recently I learned that I have made a terrible, terrible mistake. And have committed a very bad sin by not going to confession. And... You know, I, I want to go to confession now just so I can, like, get out of a state of being in mortal sin. And I went through, like, this, uh, like, examination of consciousness sort of thing. Where it's like, there's a document about it. If you just look it up, you'll be able to find it. I was going through that earlier today. And I was just writing down, like, which ones applied to me. I, I'm not like going through how many times I've committed it yet because quite honestly I've done a lot of them way more times than I can remember and in doing that I filled out like five double-sided pages well not five but like I filled out two and a half double-sided pages so two pages and another so, well Five pages, technically, yeah. So, you know, like, <laughs> I did not realize just how cooked I was, essentially. To, to just say, like, I did not realize just how cooked I was. And I really want to get all of that off my chest. You know, go talk to a confessor, confess my sins. Hopefully, you know, re- like, reconnect with God, and yeah, 
and I'm hoping that once I do that, uh, I'm just hoping that good stuff will come out of that, because I, like, at first, I didn't really want to go to confession, just because I didn't really understand the point of it, but learning that it was like a sacrament that was given to us by God and Jesus and stuff is like, all right, so this is good. This is something that I should be doing. Realizing that was like, oh, you get me? Like, it was just like the puzzle pieces like fit together. And I was like, oh, okay. I, I have been ignoring a very important part of my faith. And yeah, so now I want to actually go and participate in that. I was meant to go today, but like, honestly, I don't even know why. I just didn't go. Like, I have, I had no excuse not to go. But, you know, I can't really change the past now. So I'm hoping that on Monday, I'll just go in, do what needs to be done, just confess everything. Well, confess everything that I'm able to remember because, again, it's, it's a very long list. And, yeah, hopefully... After that's done, I'll feel a little bit better because, not gonna lie, I've been feeling kind of off right, like, off right, I was gonna say lately and recently and they combined into one word, but I've been feeling kind of off recently and I really want to like fix that because it's like, I know it can be fixed, like I know it doesn't have to be this way and I know that there is a way to feel more like me, I suppose. And I'm hoping that by going to confession, I can start that journey towards being more like myself. You got me? I can't tell if that was like too deep for what the coffee chats are meant to be, but you know, like I just speak my mind here. That's that's what I do, and you get me. Like it's it's not really about keeping secrets, I suppose. Oh. Catch just loafing up on like a little footstool kind of thing. <laughs> but yeah, so hopefully in the coming months or the coming weeks, I'll be a lot more like I was, I suppose. Or not even like how I was, but more just a better version of who I am now. Like, that's really the only thing I can think about. Also, I've been trying to get back into drawing and poetry and music and stuff. Because, you know, like, I want to be doing that, like, those sort of things just because that's genuinely what interests me. Like, that's what keeps me going. That's like my own little personal thing where it's like, oh, hell yeah, you get me? And like, I have plans for, like when I do eventually want to start making money, I want to do like art commissions and stuff like that. And like sell poetry books and like write music and sell that. Like I don't wanna be one of those influencers, well, I don't want to be an influencer in general, but I don't want to be one of those influencers that like sells like the ebooks. Like, you know, the ones where like they just sell like the scams and stuff. I don't want to be one of them. I want to like, if I feel like I have knowledge that can help people, I want to put it out there for free. Like, I don't want to put that sort of stuff behind a paywall. I want to, like, the only thing I really want to be making money off of is the art that I make. Like, I think I've come to the conclusion of like, 
Give me a second. Ah, okay. All right. All right. Oh. <laughs> I should really get like a stand to put the phone in to like record. But anyway, back to what we were talking about. I feel like I've made like the decision on about if I want to put ads on like YouTube videos. And I've come to the conclusion that no, I don't want to do that. Like, you might still end up getting ads just because YouTube's like that. But I myself don't want to be putting ads on my videos because that just, I feel ruins the vibe of what these videos are meant to be. Now, in saying that, I'm not saying that it's certain. Like, not right now at least. For now, it's like, all right, yeah, I'm certain right now. But in the future, that might change. And if that does change, I will make it known. Because, I don't know, just, well, right now I don't really have the choice. Like, I can't put ads on my videos because I don't have enough watch time. But in the future, when I do eventually have the watch time to do that, it could very well change. I don't really want it to change because I feel like it detracts from the type of videos I make, but it could very well change. So for now, and hopefully for the rest of this year, I have decided against that, but in the coming years, that might be different. All right, coffee's down. So yeah, that's everything I have to say today. Thank you for watching and keep running when no one else is.